and that is because of the efficiency of HHO having its own oxygen supply. So you must do that. If you notice, this is a propane setup, and they, they're running on propane or natural gas, actually. This works on either one, and they cut off the air. You know, there's no air going to this engine, and they're running it just fine that way, too. So, um, and if you let any other air in there, you and there's a little bit of air that's always seeking in there. This is not a, a, a perfect seal. It's just two metal pieces that fit flush together. So, you know, they're pulling some air in there, but... Um, you can run your car right off of propane this way, no problem, and you don't even have to change your timing or compress natural gas, and uh, it works just fine. So, I hope I answered some more of your questions. These are the shutoff valves for the gasoline, um, and uh, yes, I shut them both off, and I have to close the air off so that I can get a vacuum on here so that I can actually pull hydrogen from my unit. Okay, if that's open, you never get any hydrogen. And uh, if these are on while you're running hydrogen, it's all good and fine. You'll notice the car idles up a little bit, but you need to shut it off and you'll run on hydrogen and uh, HHO just fine. So please email us using contact us at Advanced Tech Engineering if you have any questions. I would be happy to tell you anything you want to know about this. This is exactly how Daniel Dingle in the Philippines runs his car. He uses his own setup, which he has manufactured. But if you watch his material closely, and that's where I got this idea from. It's not my own. It's actually his and uh, Carl Sellers. Um, they understood that. And if you listen to Daniel Dingle, which it's hard to uh, understand him, um, but and you watch all of his videos, there's there's all kinds of information in the background mounted on his walls and stuff. That if you can pause the video, you can see what he's doing. He uses 98 amps, which is not quite enough power, and you can hear the car clicking because of it when he's driving it or when the the reporter's driving it. So he cuts off all the oxygen to his car, or not oxygen, ambient air. He doesn't have an intake. He just uses whatever he's making out of his HHO, the oxygen in there. And that's how he runs that car on just HHO. It's the same thing. That is one of the major keys. Now the Joe cell, that's a whole different ball game which I don't understand and I have yet to even research it. So um, anyway, please feel free, feel free to ask us questions and please use our website to ask. I don't like, again, I don't like posting comments on YouTube because it causes a lot of fights actually. I've read a lot of other people's comments and then somebody comments, next thing you know everybody's commenting on the same thing and one guy's left defending himself, which isn't really fair because uh, why, why would anybody lie about this? It doesn't help me and it doesn't help you guys. So this is real, all right? And uh, I appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you later.